Okay, to make your prayer jar, you are gonna need a little jar, like this one. You're gonna have to find a little jar. Um, you're gonna need a, your glue. You're gonna need a cup for your glue. Uh, you're gonna need a paintbrush. You're gonna need your five craft sticks. And you're gonna need your tissue paper, which you're gonna take your tissue paper and before you begin, you're gonna tear your tissue paper up into little chunks. See, so I've got some pink and some red and some purple and some blue tissue paper all torn up like this. So you got all your tissue paper torn up Then you're gonna take your glue and you might need a, need a grown up to help you with this. You're gonna pour your glue, just a little bit of glue. You don't need a lot of glue. Pour your glue into your cup like this. All right, so you got your glue in your cup. Put the lid back on your glue because you don't want to spill your glue. Like that. See? And then you're going to take your little jar and your paintbrush. And the first one, it kind of helps to dab a little bit of glue on the back. So I'm going to take a purple one first. Doesn't matter what color you pick, but I'm going to pick a purple one. Put a little bit of glue on my paintbrush. Just dab a little bit on the back like that. And then you're going to stick it. Oops. Someone's making noise in my house. You're going to stick it right on your jar like that. And then you're going to take your paintbrush. And you're going to paint, paint, paint over, over it on like this. Just paint, 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 paint. It's all stuck down real good. Like that. Let's see. And then now that you've got that first one on, then you can take another one. I'm going to do a blue one now, and you're going to put it just however you want to, anywhere on the jar. And you're going to paint over it. Da, da, da. See? So it kind of makes like a like a cool stained glass effect. Um, if you're really creative, you can like tear like designs in your uh, tissue paper. Like maybe you want to make a heart or stars or your dog or your sister, I don't know, whatever you want to do, but you can do it however you want. So you're just going to keep on going just like this. And put another one down. Paint, paint, paint. Just going to keep going. What I like about this is see it kind of like you can kind of see like when it overlaps like it makes a really cool like kind of changes the color of it even. So there we go. So now I've got it all covered. Look at that. See how fun that is. And now I'm going to put it aside and while it's drying you're going to take your craft sticks and you're going to take the list of prayers on the little stickies like this. And then you're gonna peel off a prayer and stick it on the craft stick like this. See, like that. And then you just kind of wrap it around, wrap it around so it's all, it says, pray for first responders. And you can put it in your jar. You can take your other one. Let me Name three things which you are grateful for. Put it in your jar. So then once you've got all of your craft sticks with your prayers on them, then you can, if you ever like need an idea for something to pray, you just come over to your jar and you pull out your craft stick and you say, oh, pray the Lord's Prayer. Well, pray the Lord's Prayer. Shall we do that together right now? Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen.